Tyler here from GarageWarrior.com, a website community dedicated to helping people get better results with their workouts. And today I want to talk to you about using movement progressions in your workouts to boost your fat loss results. And so I wanted to give you an example of what a movement progression is, but first let me ask you this question. What exercise do you think burns more calories faster? I'm going to show you two different ones. So is it this? Right? kind of a simple version of a burpee, or is it this? Obviously, the second exercise is going to be the exercise that burns fat faster and gives you much better looking body. So here's what I want to talk to you about is movement progressions and, and how you can use them in your training so you get better results with your fat loss. So I gave you two examples of a burpee, and I want to show you guys how you can go from starting at super simple exercises like the first one I showed, or even simpler, all the way to the advanced exercise I just showed, which is the full chest to deck burpee. So why this is so important is if you constantly try to make your movements harder in your workouts, well then you're going to get better calorie burn, better fat loss results in much less time, and you're going to be stronger and more prepared for daily life because you're using functional training exercises. So let's take that burpee again, I'll show you some simple movement progressions. The first one, if you're completely new to exercise, is just simple called a touch jump. So you touch the ground and you jump. That's it. That's all you got to do. And once you get to the point where you can do a couple sets of 10 or 20 reps, then you can do the second exercise, which I just showed, which is stepping out and stepping back. Stepping out and stepping back. Once you can do about 10 or 20 reps of that, then we can do a squat thrust where you put your hands down, you jump out and back. And then once you can do about 10 or 20 reps of that, you jump out, drop the knees, do the push-up, back to your feet, back up. And then finally, once you can do 10 or 20 reps of that, then we can do that full burpee with the full push-up. And so that way, you can start wherever you're at along that movement progression of those five different movements and continuously work your way towards more complicated exercises that will get you better results in less time. Now, if you guys are interested in learning dozens of different movement progressions for the lower body, for the upper body, for your core, for your warm-ups, even for your nutrition, Click the link below and check out the awesome sale I'm having right now. I'm doing a huge celebration, and all of my programs right now are 50 to 70% off. So check it out if you guys are interested in learning how you can use movement progressions to get better fat loss in your workouts. Thanks so much for watching.